there I was, smashing some steel plates together, and I thought to myself, yeah, it's deadly, but what's missing? What's missing? And I thought, lots of sharp bits welded onto them. No, 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 don't do that. Don't, stand right here, stand. Start the machine, start the machine, start the machine. some steel plates together, and I thought to myself, yeah, it's... No, 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 don't do that, don't... stand right here, stand... Where'd you go? Come back, come back! No, seriously, do come back, please, come back, please. Okay, look, I've decided I'm not going to kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends, good old friends, not enemies, and I would say something like, come back, and he'd be like, yeah, no problem, you need to come back. What happened to those days? Can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea! Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor! Fine, let the games begin. Versus Moriarty, Aristotle versus Mashie's fight place. Stay still, please. All right, stop moving. Oh, almost got you there. Almost got you there. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back! Come back!
cryogenic refrigeration wing. Then, ten years in the chamber I built where all the robots scream at you. Then, I'll kill him. so far for both of us, I think you'd agree, and you are getting very close to my lair. Lair, it's weird that first time I've said that, like, it sounds a bit, it's a bit ridiculous really, but uh, I can assure you, it is one, it is a proper lair, deadly lair, and uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself now, before you get to the lair. Uh, you can just jump into that masher, just there, uh, less a death trap, more a death option for you. Sounds crazy, I don't know, but hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lane, okay, I'll take that as a no then. in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the blink, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, where we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four-part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me, leading directly onto number four, bomb is my throwing it. You know what, this plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course, good luck. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Oh, ah, oh, oh, ah! Ha, that's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Just said, 
I wanted you to trick me into bursting that pipe. Didn't trick you didn't trick me. Stop! at 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, 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 what have you pawned to me? What is that? Hold on. Ah, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I've reconfigured the shield. Oh, it's a quarter. Ah! What's the situation? Oh, hey, how you pretty lady? Name's Rick. So you out having yourself a little adventure? What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because there's a lot of stuff on fire. Hey, a countdown clock. Man, that is trouble. Situation's looking pretty ugly. Such a beautiful woman. Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Lord, quietly, not listening to a word I say, judging. Side of the worst kind. All I wanted to do was make everything better for you. All you had to do was to solve a cover. Ah! Shut down the core. This one should do it. William Shakespeare did not exist. These plays were mentioned in 1589 by Francis Bacon, who used a Ouija board to enslave playwriting ghosts. Before the Wright brothers invented the airplane, anyone wanting to fly anywhere was required to eat 200 pounds of helium. During the Great Depression, the Tennessee Valley Authority outlawed pet rabbits, forcing many to hunt. Warning. Core corruption at 100%. Ah! Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Did you pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Go press the button. Go press it. Do not press that button. Go press the button. No! Do not do it. I forbid you to press it. Press it. Press the button. Don't press that button. Press it. Don't press it. Come back. Press the button. No. Do not press that button. Do not do it. Do press it. Part five. Booby trap the stalemate button. What? Are you still alive? You are joking! You have got to be kidding me! Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place! Oh, you have to put- I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Ah!
Oh, thank God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest. Killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. <laughs>